Guillaume Apollinaire was a French poet, playwright, art critic, and literary figure, known for his innovative literary techniques and his role in the development of the avant-garde movement. He was born on August 26, 1880, in Rome, Italy, as Wilhelm Albert Vladimirus Apollinari Kostrowicki, to a Polish mother and an unknown Italian father. Apollinaire grew up in France and attended school in Cannes and Nice before moving to Paris in 1899. There, he studied law and worked as a clerk, but he also began to explore the city's vibrant artistic and literary scene. He became associated with a group of young writers and artists who were experimenting with new forms and styles of expression, and he soon began publishing his own works. In 1911, Apollinaire published his first major work, a collection of poems called Alcools, which is now considered a masterpiece of modernist poetry. The book is marked by its use of free verse, fragmented syntax, and experimental forms, and it was praised for its bold and original approach to language and image. Apollinaire was also known for his work as an art critic, and he was a champion of the emerging Cubist movement. He wrote extensively about the work of Pablo Picasso, Georges Braque, and other avant-garde artists, and his critical writings helped to shape the direction of modern art. During World War I, Apollinaire served in the French army, and he was wounded in battle. He also contracted the Spanish flu during the pandemic of 1918, which weakened his health and eventually led to his death. He died on November 9, 1918, at the age of 38, just two days before the end of the war. Apollinaire's legacy as a poet and literary figure has continued to grow in the decades since his death. His work was influential in the development of the Surrealism movement, and his poetry is still widely read and admired for its lyricism, imagery, and innovation. He remains an important figure in the history of French literature and the avant-garde, and his impact on modern poetry and art cannot be overstated.